In this video, I'll show you how to set up recurring payments using the Commonwealth Bank app on your mobile device. If you find this video useful, please leave a like and subscribe to our channel. In saying that, let's just jump straight into this video. All right, open up your Commonwealth Bank on your mobile device. Make sure to log in. Once you have logged in, you'll be brought to the main page of the Commonwealth Bank app here. And then choose which account you'd like to set up recurring payments from. So for this demonstration, I'm gonna choose my Smart Access. And then what you want to do from here is click on to pay. And then you can either do a recurring payment using BPay or pay someone. But for this demonstration, I want to click on pay someone. And then you're brought to this page. And now from here, if it's a new payee or a new bank account, you'd like to set up recurring payments. What you want to do is click on the plus icon, top right hand corner. And then you can even choose mobile number, bank account or overseas transfer. So for this demonstration, I'm going to click on bank account. And now what you want to do here is put in the account name, BSB and account number. And then once you've done that, click on search payee details. Or you can go back to this page here. And if you've already got that bank account saved into your list of bank accounts saved on your mobile app here, just choose that one. So for this demonstration, I'm going to choose this bank account. So once you added in your new um, payee or bank account details, you'll be brought to a page that looks like this. So from here, you want to scroll down a bit and you want to click on recurring, and then choose how much you like to um, how much money you'd like to recur. It could be weekly, bi-weekly, monthly, etc. So for this demonstration, I'm just going to put in one dollar, and then you want to add in a description. So I'm going to type in just test, and then you can set your frequency. So what I'm going to do is set the frequency. Well, here you go. So you've got weekly, fortnightly, monthly, last day of the month, etc. So I'm going to do a, a monthly payment and then click on OK. And then you can choose the start date. So for example, if I want to start this next Friday, I'll click on Friday and click on OK. And where it says end, click on to that. So you can end it by a certain date or a number of payments or no end date. It can just be a recurring payment that never ends. So for this demonstration, I'm gonna click on number of payments. I'm gonna click on 10 payments. And then once you've done that, click on next and then click on confirm to confirm the recurring payments. I'm not gonna click next because I don't wanna recur this payment here. So yeah, that's the end of this video. Thanks for watching.